Hey, what's going on, guys? Simon Sky here, and welcome back to a brand new video. But this is not really gonna be a video. This is more like you know evidence or like you know a video, pretty much me like catching a scammer and all that and see bro. I'm technically not really like considering this is a video just because of that, and also this is not really like what I usually would upload. But this video is pretty much me just reporting this person, so this person can pretty much get banned. And I have pretty much really good and hard evidence against this person, so. Yeah, if this person has any, like, claims or any, like, proof that he wasn't, then he can pretty much explain it from this video. Just want you guys to know one thing is that I have no sympathy nor any pity towards any scammers like this because they have the intellect to actually get this many stuff like this, like the variant camo, which is worth a lot of skins or knives. It's not really technically, you know, the best, best, but it's, like, really worth a lot, though. Uh, this person... Uh, named Logan, he tried to scam Coco when I was AFK while my cooldown was still active and then once I came back I saw in the chat uh, You know that Coco and Logan were like interacting with each other and then Coco said, you know nice try new for trying to scam me So pretty much Logan once he was like cold out or you know pretty much uh, you know caught He just like shrugged it off like it was nothing and then he tried to go to me He pretty much private chatted me when I didn't even pretty much just like I didn't even talk in the uh, chat at all and then he just pretty much private chat me so what he said was you know can I have your variant account for 750 robux that's a really low deal but you know I knew that this guy was a scammer so I did what I decided to do was record this person and see if this person's a scammer or not because you can't really you know say he's automatically a scammer you need to have evidence and proof you know against this claim or your assumption that he is it was already obvious from the get-go that he was a scammer because of what coco said so that's one point or like a proof i guess that's a way to actually you know assume that he's a ha you know a scammer i'm not hackers just a scammer uh, i asked him if uh, i can actually make a shirt and then i'll link it to him on discord because i knew this guy was trying to scam me because he said you know you know, give me your variant camo and then press accept and I'll give you some of your 50 Robux. That's not how you get Robux. That's not how it works, you guys. You can only get Robux is if you redeem, you get it get you get it by group funds or you get it by game pass or by a shirt or just whatever. But those are the main four that you can actually get Robux from. But this person's saying, you know, I'll give you some of your 50 Robux. So that's one way to actually know that this person is a scammer. There's actually many ways that you know that this person is a scammer, but this is just like one type of it. Or just like just barely what it is I guess pretty much I asked this person for his discord next you know he's saying you know my discord got hacked like a retard I just want to let you guys know one thing if your discord account got hacked you can always make another one and not only that you need to contact or let your friends or the people in your discord servers know that that account got hacked so they can ban or kick him and also they can pretty much like try to restore everything the way it was on that new account. That's what a smart person would do, but this guy's a dumbass. What I decided to do was like, you know, tell him, okay, can I, you know, get the Robux by the group? And he said, yeah, sure. What was really odd and what was really stupid, like I'm going to tell you guys right now how stupid this was and how retarded this kid is. He pretty much invited me or he pretty much gave me his group that only had two people in it. Two people. All right, just pretty much let that sink in your head for a little bit. Two people, okay, including him and the goddamn group, okay. I joined, he accepted me because there's that approval bullshit whenever you're joining and all that. So, you know, I pretty much accepted it. And then once that happened, he talked to me saying, you know, okay, I'm going to give you the 750 Robux and then you have to press accept. So he pretty, he pretty much been doing that for quite some time. And I know that this person was lying the whole time because he's saying, you know, there's a delay. He was like in another country. He was in another state, whatever. Uh, I'm just like being, you know, using it as a joke there. But he said he was in Australia. So pretty much what this person was saying, you know, okay, I gave you 750 Robux. Please, uh, you know, put the variant camo in the, you know, in your offer and press accept. What was really fishy is that this person didn't give it to me at all for the past two minutes when I was talking to him. That's how you know that there is no Robux given to you. And also one thing to point out is that there is no delay when you do a transaction on group funds. It's a it's a instant transaction. You should get it by the next minute or at least 30 seconds. That's how instant Robux is. So this person is telling me, you know, he sent it, accept it, accept it. And I said, okay, 
Um, I'm just going to wait until I actually get 750 Robux. Two minutes later, it's not even there. So, um, you said, you know, accept it and it will be there. What the fuck? He said he's going to wait and all that. And then what actually really pretty much made me confirm that this person was a scammer is that, you know, oh my god, I gave it to my friend. Okay, remember how I said there's only two people in the server? Well, that's what made me know that this person was lying the whole time. He pretty much said that he gave it to his friend. He gave 750 Robux to his friend. Okay, one flaw to this point is that if you have a group and you have Robux in it, once you do like a payout, you have to search the person's name. What really kind of made me knew that this person was a lying little piece of shit is that this person typed my name in the private chat even though I didn't type anything. That's one way you know that this person's a liar because he knows that he's, you know, you know, like he knows your name, but he's going to pretty much just try and lie that he gave to his friend. Dude, there's only two people in the goddamn freaking group. How can you mistake your friend for me, you goddamn retard? So, uh, he kept telling me to freaking accept it and all that stupid shit. He, he just don't even keep on going saying accept it when he said he gave it to the, you know, to his friend or the wrong person. And that's how retarded this kid is. So, yeah, in conclusion, guys, please make sure that you use your common sense when you're trading with people. And never trade with people that are good to be true. And also, don't trade with people that are offering Robux because that's like one clear indication that that's fake. So, please avoid those people if possible. And also, uh, one thing I want to point out in this clip right now is that this person's telling me, you know, click accept in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Like, I'm going to do it. He thinks I am a little kid. Yet, he doesn't realize that it's simulated sky behind the freaking account. Like I said again, I'm going to put every scammer on blast every time I encounter on them. So, there's actually going to be those type of people where they say, okay, this is going to force sky. Why are you putting, you know, his info in, you know, in the description or something like that? Or something similar around that. Okay, first of all, the thing you really don't understand is that if they have this much intelligence to actually try and deceive me, but they failed, but they made it look like it's, you know, it's a legit trade offer or like a really cool offer for Robux and all that, then they need to be put on the spot. They need to be banned, okay? There is no, okay, I'm gonna give you a warning. That's not how it goddamn works. So yeah, that's gonna be it for today's upload. There's not really much that I have right now because school starts next week and I have to prep and all that. So there's gonna be more videos though. I'm going to be trying to get back into daily uploading as much as I can possible because I've been inactive as hell for the past four weeks, I guess. So yeah, I hope you guys learned something from this and also uh, devs, you're welcome. And also thank you, I guess. I hope I get a cool blue skin as my reward sarcasm there but all in all um i'll make more videos sooner or later when i have the time so yeah hope you guys uh, learned something or enjoyed the video and i'll see you guys next time